He said, three times a year, you bring me a special offering. And you bring the first fruits. You go out and you bring the first fruits, the first gleanings of the fruit that comes ripe first. And you bring it in and you let the priest wave it before me as a wave offering before the Lord. To operate in obedience, you are demonstrating your love. You can't say you love God and not obey Him and not obey Him. Tithing is the master key to obtaining the blessing. I don't think anything will be blessed, spirit, soul, body, finances, or relationships, when a person says, I'm a Christian, I operate in the kingdom, but they refuse to die, but they refuse to die, but they refuse to die. And if you work and don't pay God, you won't get fed. Where my run is at? Where my run is at? What's this? When you give tithe, when you pay your 10% of gross, of gross, you are giving God your faith. I believe you're going to open up the windows of heaven. Second title, a little subtitle. Debt's the main title, but right under the second title, guess what it stands for? Debt. Doing everything but tithing. You need to realize the more that you give, the more that you give, God will give back to you. Together. Yes. Oh, dear friends, the prophets, priests, and kings looked forward to this day. Yes, they did. They saw it. They knew it was coming, but they didn't get to be blessed by it. We are that fortunate That's right. generation That's right. that are alive on planet Earth. Right. Just see it come to pass. That's right. That's did you know you're rich? Yeah. Man, you already know it. Well, good. <laughs> if you didn't, I'm going to tell you why. That's right. Galatians 4 from the Living Bible, last verse of chapter 3, last, yes. Now that we are Christ's, we are the true descendants of Abraham, and all of God's promises to him belong to us. It's mine, and I don't have to wait till I see it in the natural. I've already 
we find ourselves wishing but we don't do anything about what we wish uh, I wish I had a better job I wish I had a better car and I'm founding what I've given you in your mind upon an action that took place in the past and I have rooted your wish upon an action that took place in the past that guarantees that guarantees that guarantees that you will have a future and what I've done is I have taken what you call the wish but what I call a vision and I have planted it in Jesus